Yeah, so guys, today our president was going to the stage to address the nation on the Democracy Day. And can you imagine, our president fell down. He fell down while climbing the stage, you know, to give his speech. But this is raising a lot of questions in on, on social media and everywhere right now. The people of the community are worried. A lot of people are asking questions, you know. They want to know what's really wrong. Is this like an embarrassment to you as a Nigerian? What can you say about this? Let me know your opinion in the comment section because it's kind of something, you know, something that keeps occurring severally. You know, this is not the first time this is happening and people are beginning to wonder for a country like Nigeria with the large economy, you know, as a giant of Africa, the president is going on stage to, you know, to address the economy and it's collapsing on stage. Nigeria is a giant of Africa with over 200 million in population, with so many giant and strong youths and so many prospects there. But with this happening, well, I cannot, no, I cannot say if it is exactly some health challenges that he's facing or some kind of breakdown. I can't say, I can't pinpoint it exactly, but what is really going on? What do you think about this? Anyways, let me know your opinion in the comment section. Do you think he's fit to rule this country? Or do you think he should, you know, just step down and get some rest, go on a vacation, you know, just retire? Or do you think he needs some support? What do you think as a Nigerian, as a, as a compatriot, as, as a fellow Nigerian, what do you think? Because this is raising a lot of concerns. A lot of people are worried about this occurrence that is happening all the time. You know, whenever he goes on stage, this thing keeps happening. But Nigeria, with the prospects Nigeria holds, with the economic abundance, so many things that need to be taken care of. Do you think our president, Tinebu Bolaji, aka Jagaban, do you think he, he's got the potentials or the strength or the mental stability to be able to drive our economy, to be able to drive our nation? Well, anyways, let me know your opinion in the comment section. But then if you watch this video, you want to also check out some Nigerians who are doing great out there. For example, Javis, the TikTok AI girl, I'm really, really impressed and proud of that girl right now because she's doing great and she just landed a 200 million deal with an AI Chinese company because of her performances online where she mimics AI robots and she performs exactly how these robots operate and yeah, she's doing great. She's doing great for herself and yeah, her TikTok page just hit 1.4 million yeah, followers and I think Instagram too hit 1.3 million followers recently. So there are so many Nigerians out there who are doing great for themselves and making millions online. So anyways, if you want to check out this girl, click the link in on the screen to check out how this girl is going and how she's performing. And then I'll see you in this video. But before you go, don't forget to let me know what you think about this Tinibu's whole saga in the comment section. And like the video, share with your friends if you want. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel to follow me and support me. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.